Hey car friends and welcome back. So today I'm coming to you guys with a one month update as promised on the Beauty Forever Deep Wave Hair. So before we get into the update, let me just say y'all, I am absolutely loving this hair. And this is literally one of my favorite wigs to throw on. I absolutely love the hair so far. But before I get into all of my opinions and my tips and tricks for the hair, let's get into the specs in which I ordered to remind you guys of what I got. So I got the Beauty Forever Brazilian deep wave in three bundles as well as a curly closure now for this line they didn't have any closures to match the deep wave line but they did say that the curly closure would blend very very well which I must attest it does blend very very well so I got a 22 22 24 and an 18 inch curly closure my closure is a free part closure so I'm able to customize it however I like I went ahead and just made a middle part and whenever I want to do a side part I just shift the entire wig to create that side part. And if you're wondering, the closure is a four by four piece. So, so far I've had the hair in for a little bit over a month. I know I told you guys I was gonna come back in a month, but it got super, super hectic and I got behind on video. So it's been about a month and a half, very, very close to two whole months. And I legit have been wearing this hair nonstop. I have not tried on any other wigs. Anytime I have to run anywhere or go and do anything, I am throwing on this wig. This is like my go-to wig right now. So I do not have any cons for this hair. Like I said, this is one of my favorite textures of Beauty Forever hair to work with. It has become one of my favorite favorite wigs that I've created but I don't have any cons so I'll just get straight into the pros first. So the hair is super super thick. Like I said I got two 22s and a 24 inch bundle as well as an 18 inch closure and the hair is super super thick. Now I usually wear my hair just like this. I'll go ahead and wet it down use a paddle brush to define the curls as well as some Cream of Nature Argan Oil Curling Mousse I believe it's called and I just put that on the hair to hold the curls. I'll wet it down in the morning, go about my day when I'm driving the hair is pretty much drying but it's my gets my desk destination the curls are pretty pretty defined they still have their their curl pattern and the hair is still super super soft and manageable so that is what I've been doing to the hair and the hair like I said is super super thick right here you can see it's still it's a little bit thin looking because of the fact that it's like wet I just like wet it before I came on camera but the hair is super super thick so keep that in mind when you're ordering their deep wave texture so the bundles are super thick but they are very lightweight I have three bundles like I said and a closure and this is not super heavy hair it feels pretty normal to me it feels like my own hair pretty much it's not heavy at all this hair is very versatile you can wear it pretty much wet or dry whatever is your preference I like very very big hair but like I said I like to keep things very very simple so I just pretty much just spray it down in the morning and let it get big over time until it gets way too big for my liking and it's like too much for like everyday wear is when I'll go ahead and wet it down. So let's get into hair care and how I've been maintaining the hair. To be quite honest guys this wig has been everywhere. It's been in the car, it's been downstairs on the floor, it's been in my room on the floor. I actually just got it out of my room on the floor. I am super super busy so my wigs are pretty much everywhere. This hair I can say no matter what I do to it, no matter how tangled it gets or wherever it's thrown, when I put it under the water I don't even have to brush it down before I drench it under water. It will not tangle up under water. I pretty much just take the dry wig that's been thrown everywhere, put it under the water and go ahead and start brushing through and the curls, the tangles, everything just washes right on out. All the tangles just go very very smoothly through. This hair is like like really really it can be high maintenance for someone that's not used to curly hair but to me it's super low maintenance because you're not sitting there section by section you know detangling the hair the hair pretty much does very very well it's on its own so I've been wetting this hair daily because like I said I like the wet look this is how I've been rocking the hair pretty much so I do manage the hair daily even though it's on a wig I did sew down a wig for a little bit about three or three to five days I believe I had it sewn down and in that instance I was still wetting the hair every morning but at night I went ahead and braided the hair into two big cornrows or two big plaits if I'm super super lazy and just tie my hair down with a satin cap. The paddle brush as well as a spray bottle will become your best friend when it comes to this hair. This hair takes the paddle brush and the spray bottle really really well. Like I said I've been using just one product which is the Cream of Nature Curl Defining Mousse I want to say. It's the Argan Oil Mousse from cream of nature. I've been using that every single time I want to style the hair and it holds very very well. It doesn't leave a crunch to the hair. This hair takes that product very very well. So I've just been sticking to that since that's been working. So I think the mousse is like one of the best products to try on the hair especially for the deep wave pattern and the curly closure to blend it all together. I love to wet it down. 
run the brush through the two textures and kind of blend the two together and let it air dry in that state. This hair does hold moisture pretty, pretty well. It doesn't get super, super dry. It does get dry, like I said, it's curly hair, but it, it does not get super, super unbearably dry, like feeling like straw. The hair just feels like normal curly hair throughout the day. I've worn it on pretty hot days as well as some cold days and it's done pretty, pretty well, even in the rainy days. And as far as the closure, the curly closure, I feel blends really, really well. I think, like I said, putting the water in the hair and petal brushing the entire hair all together makes the curls pretty much just blend all together. You can't really notice the difference between the curly hair and the deep wave hair too much because I petal brushed it and it helped to define the ends of the deep wave hair to make it look like it's pretty much curly hair and it's blending in with the other texture. The hair is super, super affordable, which makes this hair like one of the dopest hairs to purchase. I'm telling you guys, it's super, super affordable, not super high maintenance for the price. And I think it's a very, very great investment. So let's get into some quick maintenance tips and then we'll be on our way. So first things first, like I said, the petal brush and the spray bottle will become your best friend. This hair does require daily maintenance, especially if you're gonna sew it onto your hair, you will have to do something with it every single day. If you sew it on a wig, you could probably get away with maybe one to two days or so before the hair gets super, super big unless that's the look that you're going for. So I highly suggest if you want to keep this hair as a semi low maintenance, medium maintenance kind of hair, go ahead and sew it on a wig cap and create a wig with the hair. If you're going to do a sew in, just be prepared to do something with it every night. Braid it up or something that way it doesn't get super tangled and you don't have a ton of work to do in the morning. And last but not least, like I said, the Cream of Nature Argan Oil Mousse was one of my favorite products for the hair. And that's pretty much all I really have to say about the hair. I love the hair. It's still the same quality as it was straight out of the box and I totally recommend it for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you guys are feeling the hair just like I am and I'll see you guys in the next video.